Hello, my name is Linda Suck. Um, I was asked to be part of this lovely tradition sequence of, of things from our past that we celebrated with our families in the faith community. Um, when I was a little girl, my grandparents shared with us that before Christmas, we would get wheat and we would, we would place it on a, um, a dampened piece of cloth or Kleenex in a plastic container and we would put it under our bed and we would all do this and under the bed just to keep the wheat so that it would not turn green, it would stay white and it would germinate. So whatever the germination time would be, maybe eight to 10 days. After that, it would be right before Christmas. So you would pull it out from under your bed and you set it by the manger. And it was, to, I believe it was to represent the pure wheat um, of the host where Jesus, um, the wheat of Jesus in the, in the host. And, um, it, it just, it was, it was a lovely tradition that we all practiced and um, passed down in our family. Um, and it just, it made you really think about uh, the real presence of Jesus in the ceremony and in Christmas. I, I don't remember a name for it. It was just, we knew that it was the holy wheat and that, um, it was really important and, and, and it really involved children. It really got the kids involved in the birth of Jesus. That's what was really nice about it. Is, and it's something I remember. So it, I guess it worked if I remember it as a child. So it's, it's a nice one to pass on. Mm -hmm.